Okay, so let's see what the event is exactly. And mm. okay, Mercedes is back up. That'll be good for newcomers. Um, okay, so that's the rotation. I'm surprised I didn't put pictures of the heroes this time. Um, yeah, the end of the event package sales, and there's a new autumn package. What looks unusual about this package is they're giving the reset ticket. Now that reset ticket will reset a complete. That will be a complete reset. Um, you'll get all your um, what you call it soul stones back. You'll get that's a hundred percent. You get a hundred percent of all the stuff back on your character. Um, that's pretty. Um, that's pretty cool. How, uh, let's see. Oh, five. It looks like would it be five on that one as well? And what about yeah, two characters? So loads of character reset tickets. I I, I wonder. It says character right, but does that mean it will also work for um soldiers? Like, I, I mean, I think a lot of people would probably prefer soldier reset tickets. So, so I I want to know what exactly what that is. Anyway, <clears throat> so let's um. Let's continue. Late autumn event. Mm, okay, so autumn leaves are going to drop. There's a drop rate of 50%. Um, so it's all dropped from the world map. Wow. Okay, you can collect them and draw them through the town's drawing board. Whatever that means. Probably the way we always do it. Um but you can purchase a character reset ticket for a hundred coins. They're giving you, oh, one chance to get a reset ticket once a week. Okay, so that means you could theoretically get four of them. Is that, yeah, I think there's a chance for four reset tickets. Keep that in mind. That's unusual. So that's a hundred percent reset. A hundred, and then once a week, a hundred king coins for 200 gems, a hundred for a hundred maple leaves okay okay so what's going on here items required for drawing 100 not five times okay so okay remember the update is every three weeks and not two weeks so okay so three times what six times anymore no six six uh, uh, but it says the okay initialization numbers five. so so you can reset this um, five times, and then the first time. So this is actually um, there's quite a lot here. I mean, are they are they trying to push us to farm to death? I mean, if okay, so I think the first thing we need to know is what is this? Because it's not again, they're not helping with the translation here. They're not um, they're just not pasting it down. All right, uh, uh, what I'll do is let some um, translate one of them. Okay, so I, I'm really sorry about like how awful this looks, but at least I kind of got something going here. So, um, I don't know why gold would be the first prize or whatever, and I guess that's gold. I'm guessing whatever this one is, number one, I'm guessing that should be pretty good. But Rika Hero, so does that mean we're getting a new hero called Rika? Okay, so that's quite good. So the third appearance item. Now the question is, are is this actually a good deal? Are we looking at something pretty good here? Um, there's a lot of gold, a lot of gold, unique upgrade stones for heroes. I mean, I'm I'm not seeing gems, but I mean you're getting this like another like this is we're getting this like six times. So okay, I like the shoes. Okay, three sixty four eighty seven twenty. They're honouring that. But there's a lot of gold, to be honest. So clearly, people have been moaning about gold forever. But I'd be moaning about gems if I were you. I mean, okay, so gold, gold, gold. Um, gems nowhere to be seen. Legendary ticket summon. So there's a few legendary tickets. I mean, what what I think is good about this is the amount, you know. But I mean, because you get you get another three of them. Um, but yeah, I don't really know until the until it comes. So let's just get back. I was quite surprised I was pushed to having to translate this um, anyway. So, okay, I'm going to tell you if remember in the translate it said number one was Rika. So this is going to be Rika as well because it's exactly the same like wording. So it's going to be the hero Rika Rika. So so what about down here? Will we get the hero Rika three times? So you're going to get this hero Rika 
but I, I don't know if the hero is called Rico. We're going to go down and find out. But okay, so that's going to be quite interesting. And and um, one, three, and five are the same. And I'm guessing two, four, and six will probably be the same too. It looks like it. Um, okay, 28 legendary item icons have been modified. Um, what? It, oh, 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 because we're getting the new artifacts. Okay, you must remember, right? I think we get like 50 gems for each one we pick up. So that's that, that does help in some respect. But okay, so there's, yeah, we know that from the other video, the first video I put out today. Um, add a new artifact. Um, yeah, okay, so they've actually, okay, some of them are in English, but yeah, I didn't know that at the time. <laughs> um, at least they explained it here but i think the one i translated looks a bit better because it's more specific um the number of the targets for the horn on the witch's cloak yeah has been changed to two at fifth level and three at tenth level okay so yeah so i didn't i don't know how much it was in the first place it's not like um it's not like i'm a whale and i can't i can't level it up so i don't know okay so content expansion okay Guild Raid 13, yes. 14 levels of bosses, yes. One round of Infinity Wars and Goblin Mine 6, as in the previous two videos. Okay, as, as I explained. Um, reset the hero growth. Okay, it's 300 gems. Okay, they've changed it. Wait a second. When resetting the gems, loyalty nickname and 80% of the materials can't be... Wait, wait. You get 100% back if you use the exclusive item. Sorry. I'm I'm confused. Okay, so I I thought based on the petition that it was a hundred gems to get eighty and three hundred gems to get a hundred percent back. Now I'm a now I'm now that's a bit um that isn't what I expected. Um, we're going to be getting those exclusive items, but but mm, that's not what I expected. Okay, so be prepared. I mean, this is really going to hit the Koreans quite hard. Okay, so the shoe consumption, as you know, has been changed. That's why um, even right now, I'm only um, farming chaos at the moment until the update, and then I will go back to free, to hard. <clears throat> so let's see. And then also, I didn't say it, but because it's on two, right, for normal, I can actually probably farm and get gems and, and collect the gems because it, it might actually be worth, it might actually be worth to farm a place like 50 times at, because it will only cost uh, 100 shoes and 100 shoes will be literally, I don't know how to say, like maybe worth around 35 gems worth. So I think, um, yeah, normal will change because of this as well, for me anyway. Okay, a quick placement function for guild battles. Yeah, so we talked about that, and this is important for those leaders and whatever. Uh, again, come and join our um, guild. I think our Quox Q U O X. I think it will. I think we can really help on that side. Now, so the new hero is Rika. Okay, okay, healer. Ah, uh, uh, that is not what I expected. Um. You know, I'm 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 so into that. I want someone with power and damage. But let's see. Caution. There's a high probability that the badge balance will change. No, no, no. So fox, fox, fox fire flies and exploding, 570 magic damage. What? It's, it damages. It's a healer, and recovering a hundred to 150 percent of magic attack power per second to allies to what the heck this is exactly the kind of nonsense i was expecting <clears throat> to take over werebeast this is worse than i expected okay this one oh it's going to recover magic attack and give it to the allies for 10 seconds if it's giving it to allies if it if this person so rika can give a hundred to a hundred well, let's say 150% of magic power to allies, to 19 allies. This is crazy. This is absolutely insane. Forget it. It's not even a healer. This is this is exactly the kind of power. Oh, wow. This is 
This is going to cause a lot of trouble. <coughs> it will just buff anyone who uses magic attack. Magicians might end up coming back. You'll have to always take this here. So, so let me tell you, think about Natasha, right? She buffs everyone by double, actually. Like, it, it, she just, um, stick, Natasha, the one with the arrow, she will, she will stick her arrow on someone, and then anyone who hits that from Wear Beast will, they'll double. They'll double their, um, for that time, their, the, the power, whether it's magic or physical, will double. But this is actually, so she's doing something similar, but it seems it's not limited to Yatcha. It will, and it, and it's for anyone who is, uh, yeah, magician. I mean, this is quite a ma this isn't quite, this is a major increase. But let's see. So 10 seconds, but the cooldown can be probably 20 seconds. And then, okay, so it's still pretty good. So this ultimate is crazy. Um, okay, so. It is an ultimate, right? Um, or find out later. It has to be because okay, skill one, okay, maiden restoration, HP of one member. Okay, so this is just um normal. So so this so actually actually I've made a major mistake here. It's not recovering. Okay. Oh, okay. Sorry, I made a huge mistake. Um, the recovery is probably in terms of healing. It's healing 100 to 100% 100 of magic attack power, of her magic attack power per, per second for 10 seconds. So, sorry. So, this is, um, this is similar to Lavia. So, it's just a recovery. So, it's not healing. I mean, it is healing. So, yeah, so ignore what I just said. I made a major mistake there. It's these translations, like, when, yeah, the the recovering, I didn't, I didn't connect it completely. Uh, okay, so, so it's, this is like a lavia. No, not very little difference here. Gives one of your troops immunity to magic damage. Okay, so this is like a devs one. This is immunity to CC. This is like grace. This is very important. We're going to need it with all the silences. And increases HP recovery. Okay, that's crazy. That skill 2 will add all that. And then we have holy protection. Okay, um, magic defense. Okay, of the Yaturis. Okay, so, okay, let's, what does she look like? Oh, okay. Um, nice. I, I mean, yeah, quite, quite a nice angelic look. I mean, I, I really like the drawing. Wow. Okay, I'm quite, um, I'm quite happy. Oh, What's it with the foxes? I really like it. I really like, like, it's it's nice to get all these foxes, to be honest. It's like the designers are really into foxes. Well, she is rather foxy, right? Um, so, yeah, uh, interesting. Uh, okay, well, it's alright to have another Lavia, but it isn't, it isn't as power creep as I expected. So, okay, so, interesting. Let's see how the rest of it goes. Um... Okay, wow. Okay, Yatcha soldiers. Oh, I wasn't prepared. Okay. Yatcha. Okay, Dormusa. This one, whatever that is, and an archer. Okay, so we're going to have the magician. We're going to have an archer. How's... No. No, 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 no. We're not getting new ones. We're getting soul weapons. I'm honestly on the verge of going mad because of this learning to use Google Lens is irritating with with a video using a PC. Absolutely ridiculous. Okay, so yeah, so we're just gonna see the new soul weapons on those guys, and you, we already have those guys. So nothing, nothing so special, unless unless there's some major power group. Okay, so Drusilla and Julia. Okay, improvements. Meteor impact. Yeah. So yeah, five seconds, a hundred percent fire damage, four times over four seconds. So and the cooldown. Okay, so. If I remember, her soul weapon cuts off five seconds because I use her soul weapon. So twenty seconds. So a uh, um, hundred percent fire damage. It's not even going to be fire at fifty percent, and it's four times. So not only you you could say her her meter impact has been increased by a hundred percent, 
by double no it's adding another it's four times per second as well so this this in this increases a lot and will will this make drusilla worth become using her ultimate will this change things i'm not sure i'm gonna um it, it could do um i'll be the first one to check this one out now crossbow based on six stars okay she's having four crossbows um attack power 80 percent is upgrade buffed to 105 okay cooldown has also decreased okay so will i mean will this make will this make um the empire faction worthy well i use them so we'll find out i have i still have a feeling not good enough i i, I don't know if it's i don't think julia will be good enough but drusilla might but we don't know until we can see okay so but it's good they're buffing the old people you know mm. they're they're also the imperial um spear thrower and the sorcerer Let's see what they've done to this. So the fifth option, ranged evasion. So they, in, well, they get, they increased its ranged evasion. Oh, that's all. And they've increased the range of the throw. Um, I need to make a comparison between that range to uh, an elf and an orc. Um, but remember, they didn't increase the attack power. So the range is not going to be, it's not going to be great for Guild Raid. None of this is good for Guild Raid. So it might be helpful in the arena. Mm. You know what, this will, this could help them against Werebeast. But I'll only find out later. Okay, let's see what the Sorceress can do. Okay, fire poison resistance. Okay, plus twenty percent. Okay, is that a change or whatever? Magic attack plus seven. So they've made it stronger. I don't know. Uh, I can't understand this. But when an enemy is killed, skill cooldown is reset. Really? If an enemy is killed, the fireball skill cooldown is reset, and magic attack power increases by fifteen percent for five seconds on a soldier. This is a bit. Wait a minute. This this is this is crazy. Oh, are you serious? Am I going to have to change to these guys? Magic attack power increases by fifteen percent. Mm, for five seconds. Um. I'm. I. I think I might. Um. I might consider switching over to these guys. I didn't want to, but um. But I might look at it. I might look into that. Mm. Okay, so world map stages. Astania. Okay, there's another two stages added. That's nice. Okay, so so again, you can increase your farming. Um, so remember, that's easy and hard mode. And um, gold acquisition. Okay, so in Siege has changed, as I've explained before. So it depends on your guild. And other improvements, I think we've talked about this last time. Um, is there anything in particular here? No, the improvements, I think, are exactly the same. Um, purchase up to 10 items at a time. Yeah, yeah, so, I mean, the improvements are really nice. We've already discussed this in, in different videos. One's unit's own health, one's unit's own health is one's unit's, one's own unit's health. I got no idea what they're on about here but I, I do remember I think we can now um, name our weapons name our gear or something certain ones I think they've inc they've added the naming I think some people are quite excited about that okay I'm, I'm gonna stop now I think um uh, the bug fixes the reward type in siege help has been modified oh the times are different really hmm hmm I'm not sure if that's I'm not <clears throat> that doesn't based on Korean time I don't see I don't think that is a difference I'm, I'm a bit confused about that anyway we'll find out in the future 
Um, okay, so I'm going to leave it now. Club Wisdom 8 over and out.